All right, hello everybody and welcome to the webinars on air tutorial and walkthrough with me, Burt Bledsoe, coming to you live from my office here in Colorado Springs. Glad you could join me and let's do a walkthrough. So you can see I've logged into my account. I'm gonna go ahead and just schedule a webinar. You can see I have some webinars already scheduled up for this week. The very first thing I want you to notice is how easy this is to use. You go in here right away, you can just put in your title. So we'll put in here test webinar, boom. We got that done, we put in a description. This is a All right, so we type in the description. We'll put this as actually, we'll put this for, let's say tomorrow. We'll go ahead and leave it at 5.30. We'll leave it for an hour long and we'll leave the end date. I'll put it into my time zone because I'm in the mountain time zone. So I'll go ahead and do that. I have an account with a maximum of 25. I could bring that down. And when I upgrade, I'll get up to 2000 attendees and we could bring it down. If I want to only have seven people, I can only have seven. Maybe I want to max it out at 10. You can do that just by this slide bar. You can also make it a free webinar or you can make it paid via PayPal. So I'm going to leave this free. I'm going to hit, go ahead and hit save. Guys, that's it on the first step. I can add panelists. Here is where I can add guest hosts that will help me to run or be a panelist or a guest on my webinar. The next and all I would have to do, guys, is go in and add a new click the blue button, add a new panelist. I can add myself. Boom, and that's it. I hit save and it will send me now an email invite to come in and I can log in as a panelist and I just got the email. Now the third option is to come over here and use the autoresponder and as you can see, you can use Aweber, GetResponse, iContact, Infusionsoft, MailChimp, Sendy, any of these autoresponders you can actually add right in and that will create a list for you. So you can go in and create your list in your autoresponder and then come over here and tag it Boom, so you would put in your list name here and then you just hit save. So I'm gonna put none and that's it guys. That is how quick you can set up a webinar on air, guys. Is there a little bit more? Absolutely. There's tremendous amount of features that you can add in, adding offers and products, but this is how you get the webinar set up. It's now ready to launch. You can come back out here and I can come to my webinars here and I can see my test webinar. I've already got two registrants. Um, it's for an hour long and it's for tomorrow. And there's my registration link. I can now copy that and I can go paste it. I could share it on Facebook, Twitter, and Google Plus. But for now, I'm gonna cancel that webinar. And I thank you for coming on and learning a little bit about webinars on air and how you can use it in your business to get started making money using this tool to boost your Google Hangouts and boost your sales in each and every webinar. So go ahead, follow the description um, down below, follow that link, and you can go and get a seven-day free trial of webinars on air. Thanks a lot, and have a great day.